Hey, pleasant good morning to you. How many senses do you have? It says in Luke chapter 18, verse 36, and hearing the multitude pass by, he asked what it meant. He asked what it, this is a blind man. Yeah, the blind man in Luke chapter 18. Uh, listen, uh, when a person has lost one's sense, they tell me that the other senses are more keen. Uh, listen, the blind man could not see, of course. However, he knew he was aware of what is his need. So this blind man made sure that he listened well. Now, he mind his own business uh, by allowing people to tell him what was going on around him. Uh, you who have all your five senses, stop complaining. Listen, stop complaining. That's why we as adults and children should visit sick people often because when you visit the sick, you realize that, listen, they have lost a leg, they have lost a hand, their body functions are not all right. When you observe that and you visit some of these people and you see the cheerfulness that they showcase, you stop complaining. So we must not allow people to live a sheltered life thinking that they live in a sheltered life will cause them to appreciate life more. No, you must expose them to all sorts of things like visiting the sick and they will appreciate life better, especially young people and children. So this blind man, he didn't let up. He made sure that his other senses were utilized uh, to the highest so that when Jesus came along, he knew that that was Jesus coming along so that he could call for his blessing. God and Father, guide us as we go through the day and help us on a daily basis to appreciate who we are more and to count our blessings. In Jesus' name, I thank you. Amen. May God richly bless you.